Hello everybody, welcome back to Yu-Gi-Oh! 5D's Drinking Wine Edition. I think the next part of the game is when I have to do structure deck duels. I think that's what I have to go do. For some reason, you can't progress in the game until you win three structure deck duels in a row. Yeah, I have to go to the training room, which I'm actually fine with. Because it- oh, I should have saved it. It does genuinely sound fun. I do like using structure decks, like if you watched my duel on the main channel, which if you're watching my Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's Play on my Let's Play channel, I'm guessing you watched my Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel on the main Monkey Jones channel. If not, that's very strange of you. But when I dueled against Rada, uh, Rank 10 Yu-Gi-Oh!, we both used structure decks. I used a Blaze of Destruction, which is in this game. Maybe I'll use it just for old time's sake for this upcoming challenge. And, uh, yeah, I, I just really like using structure decks. Like, one- two people facing off using structure decks, it's, uh, it's a good old time. It's a gay old time, you could say. It's, you know, they're usually about equal in power. They're- they're not very good. And you just have good old-fashioned fun. Oh, and I have to do dual puzzles. Those are the worst. I don't- if, have you played the Yu-Gi-Oh! GX Duel Academy game for, uh, Game Boy Advance? The worst part of that game is that you have to win, like, either 50 or 100 dual puzzles and it's just it's too hard for me so I just have to google it and you spend about three hours of your day just going through the motions of what Google told you to do because you have to do them to win the game for some reason anyway let's use uh these are all these structured decks wow there's a shit ton we have to win with three of them and there's all these Let's go for the Blaze of Destruction to start off with, just because Monkey's used it before. Whoa, they're using it too? Holy shit, was that random? It must be random. Oh, fuck. Okay, Blaze of Destruction versus Blaze of Destruction, and we're going second. This should be interesting. Blaze versus Blaze, I like it. I like it. They must choose random, because I remember when I played this before, they, were, they wouldn't use the same one that I was using. Pot agreed. What does that do? I guess I'm about to find out. Oh, that was too quick. I couldn't figure out what the what the what the ability was. Molten destruction. That's good for both of us. I don't even have to use mine now because you're powering up my cards as well. I really really like this deck. When I beat this game uh, not too long ago, I was using like an updated version of it. I just took the structure deck and I replaced half the cards with better versions and better cards, and I beat the whole game with it. There's just something about burning the enemy that really speaks to me. No, I don't need to- I don't need to reload. Fuck off. Okay, if he's got turtle, then I guess I can go for- let's see, what does this guy do? When this card is tribute, summon this card one random card from your opponent's hand. If it was a monster card, inflict damage equal to its level times 100. That's pretty good. Tribute to the doomed might be the best way to get rid of you, because when I attack and destroy you, you can summon another monster, and that's no good. Let's throw down this. I don't really give a shit about Reload, so let's activate Tribute to the Doomed. We'll discard Reload to destroy his turtle so that he can't use its ability to get another monster on the field. And backfire to do some damage to me. That's fine. We will also summon a Blazing Impanchi. Impanchi, not Impanchi, who will have a 2350 attack. And if I know this deck well, I'm pretty sure you don't have a trap that's worth a shit. So I'm going to attack you directly for 2350. Go for it. Yep, of course it goes through. Because this deck, like I said, does not have any shit for traps. And I'll end my turn. What do you got? What do you got? Dust Tornado on my Dust Tornado? Okay. And I can't even use mine because it's the turn I set it. That's too bad. It would have been great if I countered by using it to destroy his backfire, but I couldn't do it. Oh shit! Oh shit! Is he gonna suicide? Is he really gonna suicide? No, he doesn't suicide bomb. What a fucking pussy. What a pussy. We're about to fuck his shit up, fam. Because I'm going to tribute summon. I'm going to tribute Blazing and Panchi to summon this, uh, what's his name? Thestalos, the Firestorm Monarch, who will now have 2,900 attack. Pretty good. We will discard- Wow, we discarded his Thestalos! That's what you get when you're doing a mirror duel when you both have the same deck. That's pretty crazy. Thestalos to discard Thestalos, do 600 damage. But that's not all, folks, because Inferno, you can discard a fire monster from your graveyard to remove it from play to special summon him. And I'll go ahead and summon him in attack mode. And I really, really like Inferno. Because when he destroys a monster, it does an extra 1,500 damage to the opponent. We can't do that right now, obviously. But I've, I've won a lot of duels, surprisingly, using that effect. 
this deck has so many cards that I love. Flame, uh, solar, solar flame dragon, raging flame spirit, our sprite. I'm still not sure what the word is. Um, our uh, ultimate baseball kid. If you guys knew how many duels I've won using ultimate baseball kid, uh, you would be astounded. Because he's just amazing, and I think we've got this one in the bag. I think we, even though we're using the same deck, and it looks like we've been drawing all the same cards, we're somehow taking the lead. Maybe going second is better when you're using the same deck. I don't know. I have no idea, but we're going to win this one pretty easily. Maybe we'll even go, because thanks to the field spell, all of our monsters have lowered defense. In Infernal Flame Emperor, piece of shit, piece of shit. Um, fuck that card. We're gonna summon UFO Turtle. Because of the the field spell, all defense, all of our defenses are lowered, so I have a good feeling that Inferno will be able to defeat his face down, which means we'll do a bonus 1500 damage, which means we win the duel. Go for it. Yep, Firefox doesn't stand a chance. Firefox has frozen. I've always been a bigger fan of Google Chrome myself. Let's do 1500 effect damage, why don't we? Yeah, backfire. I still don't give a shit. Backfire... Uh, if I had this deck myself, that'd be one of the first cards I got rid of, TBH fam. A Dark Room of Nightmare was pretty useful against Rada, I'll admit, but I don't really care for it. Thestalos, finish him off! One down, two to go. Let's see which starter deck we want to use next, and I'm going to take uh, a celebratory drink of wine. And we get plenty of DP to buy some booster packs later on in the game. You're damn right it was brilliant strategy. Let's go again. Let's do good. Let's go again. I think the one I want to use next will be the one that's just called Starter Deck. Let's see. Yeah, Starter Deck. Because it uses, like, um, okay, yeah, they're using... Oh, they're using Fury from the Deep, which is what Roddy used when I beat him. And I know that it's actually pretty good, so we'll have to be careful. But Starter Deck uses, um, like, Junk Synchron, which lets you summon, I think, the Junk Warrior and all that stuff. I'm, I'm halfway familiar with it, so let's see if we can't do some damage. Desk Koala is a card that I really like. It's a good way to do about 2,000 damage to your opponent on average. A Legendary Ocean right off the bat. That does not heed too well if he has a Tornado Wall, which he probably just put face down. <laughs> Uh, let's draw a monster we can attack with. What did we draw? Uh, Magna Drago will allow us to Synchro Summon. Magic Drain, negate the activation of an opponent's spell card and destroy it. Sure, let's throw that down. Uh, creature Swap is good. Desynchro. Okay, that's obvious. X Saber Galahad. If this card attacks an opponent's not relevant, but let's attack with it. Let's see if we can't get 1800 attack off. Not sure what his trap will be, but we're about to find out. Attack directly for 1,800. He's got nothing. Or, I guess she's got nothing. Take her out. 1,800 points. We take an early lead. What do you got? What do you got? You're probably going to summon seven colored fish and wipe me out because I don't have a trap that can stop you. But, ooh, creeping doom manta. Um, that's pretty shit. Why'd you summon that? What the fuck? What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, no! Oh no, I didn't even know my own effect! I should have read the whole thing! I cucked myself! His effect is when he gets attacked, he gets fucked in the ass. Of course it is. Oh, what is that? A, is that Steamroid? Steamroid? You guys know Steamroid from uh, the Roid monsters? He had a similar shitty ability. Okay, you got 1500 attack. I cannot beat that with anything in my hand right now. So I'll throw down Desk Koala in defense mode. Hopefully you don't summon anything strong enough to defeat him. And his flip effect will do a shit ton of damage to you. And then maybe I can summon Cybertech Alligator on the next turn. And then I'll have the strongest monster on the field. Ooh! Ah! Send Yumi on your side of the field to the graveyard to destroy all cards in the field except this card. Well, I have a feeling that's what he's planning on doing. Oh, no, he didn't do it. He didn't do it. Hey, I have creature swap, though, so it's not too bad. Also, we're going to do 1,600 points of damage thanks to Desk Koala, which is not too shabby if I say so myself. He destroys Desk Koala, but that's no big deal. And he... Okay, well, I guess I'm going to creature swap his, uh, his best monster. I'm going to creature swap his best monster. 
let's um I wanna hang on to Junk Synchron. I no, I don't have a level two in the graveyard. Let's summon the shitty Magna Drago in attack position. But wait, that's not all folks. We're gonna activate creature swap. And we both only have one monster, which means we're just gonna trade. And I get to keep his best monster for the rest of the duel. Which means you really cucked yourself on this one, my friend. Go ahead, Levia Dragon Daedalus, attack Magna Drago to do 1400 damage. Hell yeah! How do you like that? Hopefully they do not also have a creature swap. Because I think I've got this duel in the bag now. I stole his best monster. I, I keep saying him, but it's obviously a chick. A chick with titties. You ever seen titties before, folks? Pretty nice. Not too bad. Premature burial to summon. Who you, you bringing back that shitty fucking doom mantra? Who cares? Um. Um. You know what? Yeah, I'll magic drain that because it seems like you want to attribute that to summon something. So fuck you. You don't get that option. Um. Oh yeah, you do. <laughs> Because you discarded a spell card to stop me, so I guess you do. Never mind. Never mind. Oh, but that was it! Uh, uh huh. Okay. Strange choice. <laughs> Very strange choice. I don't know what's going on. Six, three. I'm guessing I don't have a level nine in this deck, do I? Road Warrior, Junk Warrior, X Saber. Yeah, nothing. We can. We'll throw down this fantastic face down. We'll summon the Junk Synchron, and we will attack you to get you almost... Wait, activate the effect? Do I... I don't have a level 2 in the graveyard. Do I? Do... Oh, Magna Drago? Oh! I didn't even think of that, because he's a fucking tuner. Yeah. I usually wouldn't use a tuner for something like that. Okay, well, he's in defense mode. Whatever. Let's go ahead and attack and get him down to almost nothing. Attack the Manta. Oh, wait, no. I think I win. Oh yeah, I didn't realize how much stronger I was. I win. You lose 1,300, you're down to 1,100, and now we will finish you off with a Junk Synchron for another 1,300 attack. Take him out. Good game! Two down, one to go! I didn't think we would do all three of these in the same episode, but now I've, I've done the two decks that I'm familiar with, so I don't know which one to use next. Maybe I'll just use the water one, since I just faced off against it, and I know what it is. I know what to expect, I know what to draw, I know what the strategy is supposed to be. Mmm, yeah, maybe that's what I'll pick. Maybe that's what I'll pick. What else do we have? Dragon's Roar? Dragon's Roar might be good. Dinosaur Rage, Machines, so many cool things here we could do. Let's, um... Hmm... Let's go for... let's go for Dinosaur Rage. You know what? We'll go up against the zombies with uh, some Dinosaur Rage. Let's just see what happens. We'll go for Paper. And we win, okay. I know nothing about this deck. Hopefully it has Gillosaurus, because I love Gillosaurus. <laughs> but otherwise I have no idea what to expect. No Gillosaurus this turn. Oh hey, there he is! Gillosaurus, my friend! A great card to draw on your first turn. Ultimate Tyranno, if this card is in face-up attack position at the beginning of your battle phase, it must attack first and attack all monsters your opponent controls each. Pretty cool. Seabix Blessing, a quick play. Activate only when a monster you control has attacked your opponent directly. Gain life points. E oh, cool. Okay, we'll throw you face down. We will activate Jurassic World. Hey, that's a movie! That's a movie! To boost all of our dinosaur monsters up by 300 points on each stat. Pretty cool. We can go ahead and special summon Gillosaurus. Why not? Why not? It's always nice to do that immediately before, because Gillosaurus allows them to special summon from their graveyard. So I want to do it before he has anything in his graveyard. When this card is destroyed by battle with a pyro type monster and sent to the graveyard, inflict 800 damage to both players. Seems very specific. So instead, I will summon the Sabersaurus. And we'll see if he can defeat either one of these with his zombie monsters. I don't know, does does the zombie deck have a good field spell? What is it, like zombie world to go up against Jurassic World? Hopefully he doesn't play that because it would destroy my spell. Okay, he's in defense mode, which means we can summon the ultimate Tyranno if we are so inclined. 
But the problem with that is if he has a trap that destroys an attacking monster, we just wasted three monsters in one fell swoop. When this card is targeted as an attack target, it can be changed to defense position. That's pretty cool. Um, yeah, let's let's summon you so we can tribute you next turn, because you're weak and I don't care about you. Let's go ahead and attack his face down. Oh my god, if he has... Okay, there's no way this starter deck has Mirror Force, but if he did, I'd be fucked. Attack with a Black Stego to destroy. Ooh, Pyramid Turtle, is he gonna have Ryu Kako? I think that's what it's called, Ryu Kako. That's the ultimate combo. Pyramid Turtle into Ryu Kako. Does he have it? Does he have it? If he doesn't, fucked. No, it's just another Pyramid Turtle. For now, is he going to eventually go into Ryu Kako? Because if he does, it's a 2400 attack card. I cannot defeat it. Gillosaurus, I guess attack another Pyramid Turtle, and he'll probably play another one next turn. I mean, right now, <laughs> not next turn. He'll either go into Pyramid Turtle or Ryu Kako. I have a good feeling. Probably another Pyramid Turtle. Just to Ryu Kako. Ah, oh, fuck! Ryu Kaki, not Kako. Fuck! I shouldn't have attacked. I played right into his hand. Fuck me. Okay. Here's the plan, Stan. If I can keep two of these monsters on the field, I can summon Ultimate Tyranno next turn, and then Ryu Kaki is no more. But if he summons something strong and takes out two of my guys, I am fucked. I'm fucked. What are you gonna do, boy? What are you gonna do? He's thinking. But okay, good, we're fine. We're safe. Gillosaurus is no more, that's too bad, because I really like him. But, as long as we can tribute two of you guys to summon our best card, I think we'll be good to go. Main phase two, throw down another face down, why don't you? Ah, oh, okay. I meant, uh, spell or trap, but I'm happy to see a monster, because I can attack every monster on your field with my special ability. How do you like that? How do you like that? What did we just draw? We've got Baby Sarasaurus. If this card is destroyed by an effect and sent to the graveyard, select one level four lower dinosaur type monster from your deck and special summon it. That's pretty good. Let's summon the ultimate Tyranno and hope that his trap still does not do anything. Maybe he was saving it for such an occasion as an ultimate Tyranno attack. How do you like these apples? I can attack every monster on your field with 3,300 attack points. Let's destroy that Ryu Kaki. Ah! Fuck! Ah, fuck! He got me. The whole- I lost. I'm gonna lose. He fucking got me. That son of a bitch. Ah, oh, fuck. That's painful. I'd rather you just destroy it. It's such an insult to put him back in my hand. Oh, and he's tributing. What, another Ryu Kaki? Shit! Maybe I should have used the zombie deck. It's great, evidently. Oh, 4,800 direct points of damage. How will I ever recover from this one? Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, fuck. This would have been great if I could, could have used Ultimate Tyranno. I'm going to lose on the next turn. And he has another face down trap. Fuck, I thought he was going to have three easy duels, and look at me. Ah, uh, let's go for the Mystical Space Typhoon to destroy your trap card. Oh, it's just reload. Fuck off, I don't care. Reload your hand, what a waste of time. Waste of everybody's time, you could say. This isn't a pyro monster, I don't assume. We will throw baby Sarasaurus in defense mode and probably lose on this turn, which is fine because I need to go take a nice wine piss between episodes. What do you got? What do you got, dino? No, I'm the dino bitch. What do you got, zombie bitch? You got regenerating mummy. Looks like I'm using the zombie deck next because it's, it's destroying me. It's really good. Baby Sarasaurus is destroyed, but I get to special summon a monster. Not that it'll matter. No, I guess I don't. Never mind, I lose. <laughs> hey, our first loss of the Let's Play. Well, that's okay. That's okay, it's been fun. No, I can't. What are you doing? Just, just end the duel. I lost. I guess I'm going to use zombies next, because i got to win one more of these structure duels. And then I guess we'll do some duel puzzles. Hey, folks, I'm going to go take a piss and drink some more wine. I will see you for more Yu-Gi-Oh! action in a couple days.